Firstly, I use tablespoon for measurement. This is the teaspoon. 8 tablespoon of sift flour. I use 2 ripe banana. And then I grate it, smash it, at the norug ng bonga. 5 tablespoon of sugar. 2 teaspoon of iodized salt. 2 teaspoon of baking powder. Then I use 2 eggs. 2 tablespoon of melted butter. 1 tablespoon of lemon. 1 glass of milk. 2 tablespoon of vegetable oil. I prefer to twist my banana cake, so I decided to put a one pack of Oreo cookies and then I remove the cream on it and then I smash it, but not too fine. Mix all the ingredients. I put the sieve flour, add the baking powder. And the salt and the sugar and the sugar. And now we're going to mix and whisk it all properly so that all the ingredients will blend all together. And now, we're going to put the two eggs into a separate bowl. And now, after this, we add all the liquid ingredients into the egg. Put the lemon and the vegetable oil or the olive oil or the cooking oil you can use any kind of oil the batter so i prefer to leave at least a bit for my pan later and the one glass of milk to whisk it properly so that all the taste all the seasoning all the ingredients will mix and blend all together mix it mix it mix it and now after whisking um, we pour all together into the flour and then we're going to mix it again, mix it properly until you can see that the flour is very fine already, meaning those are those ingredients are all blended. Okay, whisk it, whisk it. And then after this, um, lastly, we're going to put the grated banana. So I prefer the very ripe banana because it's, this one is it gives us um, very sweet. So no need too much of sugar. And the, the fragrance of the banana is really, really nice.
And now, after mixing, and most lastly, we're gonna put, we're gonna add our Oreo cookies. And then mix it, mix it properly. And then, after mixing, I use this kind of pan. So, no need to use a parch parchment paper. So, I'm, I'm only adding uh, my melted butter. Yeah. I'm gonna put on it so that the our cake later will not stick on the pan. And then it added also the smell. Very fragrant. Yeah. I don't have a brush, so I use the tissue actually. I rub the butter on it. And then after this, I prepared to put the pan first into the oven. Actually, mm -hmm. we need to prefer to to, re to heat the oven first into. Oh, wow. I set the oven into two hundred Fahrenheit. Yeah, we're gonna leave. Uh, we're gonna. I leave the pan there for at least um two minutes Now our banana cake mixture are ready to pour into the pan. We're gonna put on it slowly and make sure that it's all balanced. Make it flat. Yeah, pour it properly. Now, our banana cake mixtures are ready to go to the oven. Oh my God. Cook for at least 50 minutes maximum. After 45 minutes, our banana cake is done. So, we're gonna put on the plate. Yeah, here you go. Wow, it's very nice. The color is very nice. We're gonna see if its insides is cooked. Yeah, slice it. This is the finished product of my banana cake. See? This looks very nice. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like, thumbs up if you like this video. And hit the bell button so that you are notified from the next video. And lastly, don't forget to hit the subscribe.